Okay, full disclosure, this is actually a change of plan from what I was going to program and it's a kind of last minute change of plan because uh, my legs hurt, which means your legs hurt, which means the workout I had planned was going to be horrific. So I think this is less horrific. You can be the judge of that. Um, what we've got, <laughs> uh, what we've got, it's all good, it's all good, is uh, two minutes on, 30 seconds off for eight rounds, okay? So try and set a timer. If you've got like a Tabata timer, for example, that might work. Uh, two, se two minutes on, 30 seconds off, two minutes on, 30 seconds off. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna do five burpee box jumps and then in any remaining time as many dumbbell snatches as you can. Now, I appreciate not everybody can jump in their house because they maybe live upstairs or whatever. Um, so these can be burpee step ups. If you can't do burpee box jumps, they can also be burpee jump overs. So, for example, uh, I'll probably jump on something higher than this to be honest, but you can do your burpee sideways on or you can do it facing, it doesn't matter. So you could do your burpee, okay, and then do a jump onto the thing that you're jumping onto, step off or jump off, do your burpee, and you could jump over, so you could do like uh, a broad jump even, so it could be a two, just a two footed jump over, uh, sorry a two footed jump forward, not over anything, you could jump over something, you could jump over something small, uh, in the past I have had people actually just doing like big step overs, so they put like a, a backpack in the room so that they've got a big thing to step over, so you've got to improvise a wee bit when you're at home, that's fine. Uh, remember with the burpees they can be scaled so you can put your hands on a raised surface again maybe a surface a bit higher than this but you can put your hands on a raised surface jump your feet back jump your feet in so your chest doesn't go into the floor stand and then do your step up or jump up or jump over and so on and so forth so don't be scared to improvise to make this doable for you you're going to do five of them so try not make, to make it too easy for yourself either, okay, keep it challenging. Uh, five of them, and then in the remaining time you're going to do as many dumbbell snatches as you can. Switch arms as often as you like. I said dumbbell, actually what I mean is single arm, because you can do these with anything that you've got available to you. It could be a, a dumbbell or a kettlebell or a water ball. Um, this is actually based on one of the open workouts from a few years back so it had burpee box jumps and dumbbell snatches in it so you could end up mounting a lot of dumbbell snatches in this if you're nifty with your burpee box jumps uh, if you've got the option you could always make your dumbbell snatches a bit heavier that'll slow you down a wee bit uh, or you just go for it and you ramp up a lot of reps eight rounds of this only 30 seconds rest between each round, but each round is only two minutes long, which means it is a go, 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 okay? Right, should be a good Friday. Enjoy it.